Hello and welcome to a demonstration of the Welsh Allen PC-based spirometer. The Welsh Allen PC-based spirometer is very easy to set up. It consists of a USB cable which attaches to your PC and a disposable patient mouthpiece which goes on the end of the cable like so. Now when you're ready to take your patient's spirometer You go into the Welsh Allen software and input the patient's details. Now in order to get the parameters correct for the patients, the predicted parameters for FVC, FEV1, the ratio between those two and their peak flow, you have to put in as much information as you possibly can. This will include their gender, their race, their birth date, their weight in kilograms, and their height in centimetres. The software uses that information to work out their predicted results. You now connect the spirometer to your PC and open up the spirometry test module. You get a reminder about calibrating the spirometer from the software automatically. You should calibrate the spirometer every day that you're going to do a spirometer test. Now the PC will confirm back to you the patient's details and if you're ready to proceed you just need to click next. And at that point you'll see on screen the predicted results for the patient based on the details of age, weight, height, etc. that you put in. And you also get a predicted curve for the patient in their forced vital capacity test. When you're doing a spirometry test in the first instance, you should give the patient a relaxed vital capacity test first of all to get an idea of their lung capacity without any pressure. So when they're ready to take this you click record and when you see the test is ready to start the patient can pick the mouthpiece up and gently blow into it. And as you can see, their effort is measured on the PC screen. When they can't blow out any more, you press stop. And if you are then ready to proceed to their forced vital capacity test, you click on that icon at the top of the screen. Then click on record. And again, when the screen tells you that it's ready to take the test. The patient can pick it up and this time blow as hard as they can for as long as they can. The blow is accurately measured on the PC screen and it's shown on there when they're finished you press stop and you get a comparison of the blow they actually performed against a predicted blow based on their age, weight and height. The blow that they gave is superimposed on the dotted line curve as you can see on the screen. 
Now, ideally, you should do three blows, three FVC blows for a patient. So you'd go back up to the top and repeat this. At the end of the test, you click Done. And all the test results are then displayed on the screen, together with a lung age, based on the patient's performance in the spirometry test. The software will work out what the best blow was in the FVC, their FEV1, the ratio between those two, and also take the best peak flow measurement. If you want to attach any of these to your patient record system, you can do so. And if you'd like to see a full demonstration of this in your practice, please feel free to contact the MediSave team direct by telephone or via their website. A full range of spares and accessories are also available. Thanks for watching.